Hey, what's to YouTube fam? It's your girl TK and I am at home vlogging y'all and I decided that I wanted to get online real quick and talk to you guys about Miss Beyonce Nose Carter. Today we're going to be talking Most Wanted, which is a song by Miss Beyonce, which includes Miley Cyrus. Now, I want you guys to understand something. This song is definitely giving me tea. It's giving tea because when I think about Most Wanted, I'm thinking about a list, honey. There is a list out there, okay? of people who have committed some type of crime, some type of wrongdoing, some type of heinous abuse has happened. And Miss Beyonce is now singing a most wanted song. Friend, it's getting real deep. Now, before I get into this song and my thoughts about it, I want you guys to understand something. A very known man, his name is John Walsh. If you have it, um, an opportunity, excuse me, I highly recommend you look up John Walsh in America's Most Wanted. And then look up those lists like the FBI, the DOJ, and just some other list that's out there that deals with heinous crimes. And you will see what I'm talking about. But in this video right here today, darling, we're going to be talking Molly Cyrus. You know that Disney girl. As well as Miss Beyonce, Queen B. Don't want no smoke with me. Oh, yes. We are definitely going to be talking these two. And what I thought about the song. Now, one of the things I want you guys to know is, uh, honestly... Miss Beyonce, this whole album, Cowboy Carter, okay, even though I don't like the name, it is definitely an emotional, it's a, an emotional journey that she is taking us along on, the emotional journey of hearing her talk about, uh, you know, Beyonce, Beyonce in the song Spaghetti, which I have already did a video review, so you definitely need to hear it. Um, especially the ending of her original song where she's saying Beyonce, Beyonce, or people are saying Beyonce, like they're coming after her to be arrested. Oh my God, it is so emotional. And now I'm about to review the song Most Wanted. Now, oh, uh, when I think about this song, I know many people are going to say, child, a girl going to say she don't like it. Absolutely not. I'm not going to say that. You know what I'm saying? People automatically think because I'm harsh on Beyonce. I'm just going to be like, bitch, I don't even like her shit. You know what I'm saying? Tell me about Jay-Z and his cheating ass. You know what I'm saying? Did he give you an STD? You want to talk about that lemonade? But no, it's none of that. I want you guys to understand something. Um, when I think about her music, I think I, I just I, I be ready. I be ready to see what she brings to the table. Nonetheless, with Molly Cyrus and Beyonce song, I'll be your shotgun rider to the day I die. Oh, my goodness, y'all. It was definitely giving me tea. It was a very chill song. I love the combination of Molly Cyrus and Beyonce. Y'all, if y'all have not heard that song, what are you waiting for? Absolutely, it's a beautiful song. It's not one of those, you know, get crunk. No, it's not going to be. It's very chill. If you hanging out somewhere, you probably out on the beach or you just want to have a day where you just chilling. I'll be your shotgun rider till the day I die. Oh, yes. I love it, Beyonce. I love it, Miley Cyrus. I love that song and what they brought to the table. It was beautiful absolutely beautiful and honestly I, I'm shocked I'm shocked that I like the song but it was different it was definitely a different combination and um you guys should definitely check it out moral of the story um now one of the things I want you guys to understand is that I, I'm still over here kind of like like baffled. I'm baffled about the views, her analytics on YouTube. And I want you guys to know, I just got done doing a video where I referenced her analytics. And I'm like, Beyonce is struggling with her views. And this is a mega star like Michael Jackson bad. You know what I'm saying? She ain't just getting out here. But even with Miley Cyrus, who was this Disney, you know, character as well as a, you know, she's a part of the music industry, her damn self. Beyonce only got like 600,000 views on that video in two days. Michael Jackson would have had more. 
you know, millions of views. And that's the type of brand that Beyonce is supposed to be or the level she's supposed to be at. She's supposed to be on Michael Jackson level. And she's struggling with 600,000 views in two days. I'll be your shotgun rider to the day I die. 26 songs. Her people supposed to be soaking this music up, friend. And they not. And it's just, uh, it's interesting. It's really a thriller. But nonetheless, I am going to speak on it because that's what I do, baby. So, y'all let me know what are y'all are thinking about the song Most Wanted with Miley Cyrus. I want to know your thoughts, your opinions, your attitudes on it. You know what I'm saying? This is a country song. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I should be saying this is a Beyonce song. It's about Beyonce. It ain't country. Because, you know, they were discriminating against her or whatever they wanted to say. But... Back to what I was saying. Check the damn song out. Get them numbers up, up, up till we stop, till we stop. Okay, you know what? That's a cardi. Let me sit my ass down, okay? I'm finna go back over to the rap scene when I'm supposed to be country. Uh, I'm finna stay country for a second. Anyhow, guys, um, check it out. Like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what y'all are thinking in the comment section below. Period. Anyhow, peace, love, and happiness, guys. I hope you guys are out here being safe, staying blessed, following laws, rules, regulations, policies, and procedures because you don't know when, where, and or how it might uh, impact you. Also, y'all should check out John Walsh. Oh, friend. America's most wanted. Beyonce talking that talk and I'm here for it, bitch. Bye. <laughs>